Look what's been dropped off for me to have a look at. Some rusty running tools. A few there. A few there. A few more there. And a few there. That Bridgeport machine's going to be busy. While I'm trepanning this Inkinol 718 at 10 and a half inch, I thought I'd have a look at one of those tools. So I've dug one off of the scrap bin, what they've come on. That's not a bad length. 12 and a half inch it'll make I need to turn the shank down to suit these machines I'll do that first so I'm taking 125 thou off the shank this is a 6 inch shank and the machine that I'm working on is 5 and 7 eighths 125,000. I'm using a CNMG tool holder. My least favourite tool. Chris Madger's favourite tool. That's the shank finished. I'm gonna see if I can get rid of some of this rust. That's 40 grit. That should do it. I've run some 40 grit emery cloth over it to make it this nice brown colour. I made end shiny just to look nice. Right, onto the bridge port. I'll turn this round first, do the other half while I'm milling the tool right I'm ready to do a few alterations I'm making the centre cartridge sit deeper inside that's not deep enough I don't even need the Euron support table for this So I've milled it 30 thou deeper. Ground this away to help the scrap exit the front end of the tool. I need to sort those mountain screw heads. So I'm going to change this. into this still very ugly but I'm making this I'm making this just because I've got some work for this tool and it wasn't suitable how it was when I've used it I'm gonna cut the end off and remill all of it I'm doing the same to this side. That's no 
not pretty either. That's not my concern because I'm like I say I'm cutting the end off anyway and remilling it. I better go and check on the ink and all. quarters of an inch to break through. Right, I've done all I can with it. I'll build it up with the cartridges and give it a try. So that's it, ready to try. Twelve and a half inch, hopefully it will cut. A piece of 718, nine inches long. Let's see how it goes on. One revs a minute, six thousand of an inch feed rate. Just listen to that. The scrap struggling to get out. The scrap channels just aren't big enough. These are the straight cut scrap channel and they need a three degrees angle on them to help us to make more room for the scrap to come out. I can fix that. Four inch that managed to go. <laughs> Four inch. I'll put another cartridge in and put the revs up. That's now on 44 revs per minute, and it's way, way too fast for Inkel 718. I have a problem with the gears on this machine. On the low range, the slowest speed I can get is 6,000. That's why I was running it on 6,000 feet. I can get the res down to 3,000 in high range. But the high range starts at 40. What is it? 45 revs per minute. That will burn the carbide out very rapid at least the chips will be thinner that 
lasted for a quarter of an inch I'll try something else I've had two more tries and it's failed it's got three and a half inches to go so I'm going to turn it round what a pain I've gone back to my original 31 revs a minute six thousandths of an inch feed I'll do them half and half I've got eight of these to do and then I'll set about the tool and make it right at least you can see it's not all fun and games Inkinol 718 it'll be fun and games when I repair the tool but I need to get these done first it's ready for breaking through that's through before I go I'm going to try it on 22 revs you never know Two revs per minute and all is well it's got quarter of an inch to go I started out making this video just for a bit of fun with the rust with the rusty tools and it led to this it, it wasn't intentional I thought I'd just mention this while I'm here this machine the Craven Lathe I've been given the go-ahead to get it all fabricated up for trepanning so you'll be able to watch me do that that's coming up, tail top, don't need that the tool force is coming off, don't need that I'll be making a carrier same as one of those to all the trepanning tools I've got the steadies lots and lots to do so back to this and it's just going to break through it's gone slightly quiet it must be on its way through the back just another job I'll be glad to see back of these no fun with rubbish tools there it is right so I'll just carry on with the rest you don't need to see anything else that's it thanks for watching <laughs>